So it was mm -hmm. clear that we were, and we were finding things in the water. We'd been diving the coastline, and as I said earlier, next to impossible to dive for the bad visibility and, and the currents. But we did, and we kept finding unbelievable mm -hmm. flat, rectangular, huge stones the size of a small car, perfectly cut. Also done a geological investigation into a comparison, comparative analysis between what are found naturally occurring in this area quite often are striations that are caused by the African tectonic plate pushing down on the European tectonic plate. What we found under the water was first with the sonar, run our boat across and you'd suddenly you would see beep, a wall, seven and a half meters mm -hmm. tall. And we're like, what is this? Right from the first day, we started to see, first of all, a huge, huge wall that was about seven and a half meters tall, which is what, 30 feet, or just under 30 feet tall, about two meters wide, made up of giant cut stones, megalithic stones. And every single time we were finding more details that were absolutely in indicative of, of manual construction.